Hey guys, it's your girl Tinker from LJ's Kitchen and today I'm going to make the most simple salad that you can ever make. And I'm going to use pearl couscous to do it. So these are all your ingredients. We're just going to use uh, half of a red onion, a large cucumber, some capari uh, tomatoes. These go great on pizza too. And some fresh mint, some feta cheese, and some pearl couscous. This is like my new favorite thing. Now we're gonna also make our own salad dressings just with some simple ingredients like lemon, olive oil, pepper, Dijon mustard, and some oregano. You can use hot pepper seeds if you want as well. So you can just chop your tomatoes up just the way you like them. I do the same thing with my onions, or you can even use a, a, a shallot if you, uh, don't like red onions a shallot is a little bit milder and i just cut all my veggies up pretty much um the way i like it so you do the same do it the way you like it so we have our onion we have our tomato when i cut my cucumber i like to cut it into parts maybe like fours like this and then i cut them again in half and then again in thirds. So I like my cucumbers diced up like bite size. So that's what I'm gonna do with all the rest of these cucumbers. Dice it up, bite size the way you like it. Just like so. It doesn't take a long time to make this salad. Um, sorry for all the noise in the back, but you know when the family's home on the weekend, gotta compromise the space, right? And this goes great with any side dish. Literally anything you wanna put it with. A burger, you wanna eat it alone by itself. Any protein that you put with it. Um, I have some wings today for lunch. Miss breakfast, so yeah, just cut the cucumber up the way you want it. Now, you know what else will go great in this? Like some fresh corn. Can you imagine if you just put some crunchy corn in with this? This will be so. I'm not sure what you saw, but I cut up all the cucumber and everything. We added everything to the bowl. My video just shut off. And that happens, so we just gonna go with it. So I cut up cucumbers. This salad goes great with, um, and I cut up all the tomatoes. This salad goes great with any type of um, protein that you want to use. So I'm gonna take my uh, feta cheese. I added my pearl couscous to this. So we have the pearl couscous. I just toasted it up. This is the couscous. It's pearlized. I toasted it up to cook it um, just with a little bit of uh, olive oil. Toast it up a little bit and then I add my water to it. And it is so, so good. And I let it cook just for a couple minutes. So I'm going to take my feta cheese. I'm going to add a little feta cheese to this. Maybe about a half a cup. Now, let's do the salad dressing. So my salad dressing, I am going to add in, a little mess here. I'm going to add in some olive oil. Salad dressing, I'm going to add in some olive oil, just a couple tablespoons of olive oil. I'm going to add all the zest of two lemons and the juice to it. Okay, so we're going to take a couple lemons. We'll squeeze a couple lemons in. Also get the uh, lemon zest in also. We're going to add in the zest of 
two lemons. Just like so. Some Dijon mustard. And you can, there's no real measurement. You can just put in what you like. The important thing is that you have acid from the lemon, and you also have uh, some maybe some herbs in it, some seasoning, and oil that makes a good dressing. Okay, now I am going to add in a little bit of oregano. And I'm going to add in some. So here's my oregano, just for some fresh herbs, and some black pepper too. About a full teaspoon. Add in some black pepper. You can stop right there. Now, normally I would add in some salt, but because we had feta cheese, you would need no salt. I'm going to add in some some black pepper and also some of this also some feta cheese just like this and shake it up and we're going to toss this on our salad just about a full tablespoon and that's all you need for your dressing put it in a mason jar I always keep an old mason jar chop it up and at the last last minute all right this is our dressing at the last minute you're going to add in these mint leaves. Okay, so now you can very carefully, because you don't cut these mint leaves, you can also tear them. You do not want to bruise them, so you're not going to go back and forth like parsley. And then add that to your salad, just like that. Add your dressing that you shook up really good. This is your dressing and add it just like so. And add all of it. And then stir. And honey, you got yourself a great side dish, a great salad. This is how it looks. We're going to get it all mixed up and I'm going to plate it for you because I can eat this whole bowl. It is so, so delicious. You can pair with any protein. But look how pretty it is. It's so pretty. All right, let's get it in a bowl. Let this, let this be your next uh, side dish that you bring to the next cookout you go to. They are going to love it. I would just save the dressing, mix everything, and then save the dressing to add at the last minute right before serving. Look at that. Look at that. This is so pretty and so delicious. It's so good to eat. Look at that. Look how pretty that is. It's so pretty. And I'm going to pair it also with some chicken wings. So this is lunch for me. I want to make lunch for the mister. So just going to put some wings here. Some jerk wings that we had. And then add the salad to it as well. So this is how the salad looks. So delicious. And that's just the side of it. So good. Pair it with some jerk chicken. It's really, really good. Okay, so the moment of truth. Let's just taste this. It says mint. The lemon and the mustard, along with uh, the onion and the cheese, the feta. This is so good. You gotta try this for your next cookout.
or potluck for the summertime. Those beautiful tomatoes. Use whatever I see in your pantry. You can even use orange juice instead of lemon juice. I could eat this whole bowl. It's so good. And again, I pair it with some jerk chicken wings. Okay? This isn't for me. I'm going to eat mine just like this. I'm your girl Tamika from LJ's Kitchen. I enjoy making this salad with you, and I hope you try it. Mm. Bye for now.